art gallery in central Oahu featuring artists from Hawaii and around the world. It's beautiful. It's also free. Chris Latronic joining us now live from the Leeward Community College campus with more. Aloha and good morning, Chris. Aloha, good morning to you, Sam and Christine. Happy Aloha Monday to everybody. Yes, free, free admission here at the, the whole Ike Kea Gallery, brand new right here at Leeward Community College. And uh, it's only, this is actually their second showing that's already in place with their second exhibit called Facing Future, where they're featuring a bunch of faculty past and present with their art. Just the theme for this one, they're going to have many more in the future. To tell us more is Costa Lulucic, who is also a lecturer here, but also has his art exhibited here. So good morning, Costa. Good morning. Tell me a little bit about uh, this new gallery here at LCC. Oh, yeah, it's an incredible space. You know, we are so lucky to have, uh, to have this, uh, this space in, uh, in the university to be able to show all that works. And, like, you know, it's, uh, it's pretty amazing, like, you know. And this show especially because, like, I think people can see uh, how, like, uh, skilled how like the, um, the professor at uh, LCC, you know, it's the, even me, the main thing who impressed me the, during this show is that, uh, you know, like uh, all those artists, all those professors are really good professional, really good artists. And I think like uh, the, the people who come will be able to understand, provide for students and uh, uh, how we good uh, at it, you know. Yes, yes, and it's amazing, and it's also just uh, very cool to see the transition art because you're actually from France, and when you came here, uh, your art kind of changed. Tell me about this. Oh yeah, uh, as I love to say, I was tricked by Hawaii. <laughs> I, I came here like a very, very depressed French guy, and then my my art changed totally. I was totally amazed first by the beauty of the people, you know, more than uh, Hawaii itself, and uh, that's why I decided to go to paint or, or to draw these local girls and these local people from uh, the North Shore because there was something o almost magical like you know uh, here like it's uh, it's uh, extraordinary and even when you are like you know I, I love to surf and you and when you go in the water and you so see those kind of like for example those mm -hmm. young beautiful ladies who surfing they're almost mermaid or nymphaeas like who are like uh, surrounded me I was totally amazed by it and I decided to change uh, uh, my work uh, and to enter into color, into beauty, to become more positive as a person. That, that, that's, the f that's what Hawaii brought me, like, you know, in, a, in a instantly almost. Yes, that's amazing. We're actually looking at the, this great uh, picture, uh, which is um, uh, just amazing. I mean, it's, there's no color on it, but just seeing the expression and the way it is made, almost you could just add the color yourself. Exactly. And it's just, uh, just vibrant, even though it isn't black and white. But also, you have one over there, uh, over in the corner, which also is color, and it's going to be your second, uh, your second uh, art piece that's here. So tell me a little bit about that yeah, one. This is, this is also like a, a surfer from the sunset. It's called, his name is Tama, and, and you know, I met him and I was like amazed by his beauty. He looks like a statue. And, uh, and I, I tried to, to paint a very classical painting because it's Saint Sebastian. And Saint Sebastian is, a, I would say, a, a very like a iconic saint of, uh, of um, Christian culture who is also like the classical painting. All like the, the different, I would say, like. Uh, Italian uh, artists like Caravaggio, Tintoretto, they all paint Saint Sebastian and uh, I, I, uh, I choose this guy to, to make a kind of wonderful like Saint Sebastian on Sunset Beach by the way and like to, to load with these bright colors and to make something uh, almost burning, you know, uh, to have yeah. this kind of feelings that you have like when you are like uh, yeah. in front of those sunset and, uh -huh. and you know like I was totally like uh, uh, drawn into beauty when I moved like to, uh, to Hawaii yes. and that's really what I want to what I want to show in my work now. Uh -huh. And that is amazing. And I can, uh, I can attest to that because I live Sunset Beach, and that is a Sunset Beach sunset. And it's amazing just to see the fusion of art uh, with uh, all around the world with Hawaii. So amazing. And you could come see the exhibit right here at LCC. You have all the dates and times that you can uh, right on our website, khon2.com. So go check it out, the brand new whole Ike Kea Gallery at Leeward Community College. This is Chris Atronic reporting live right here on KHON2 News, working for Hawaii. Say so anything back to you. Thank you, Chris. And one of the things I love about art is that there's no right or wrong, mm. right? It's like the yeah. artist might interpret it one way and you could interpret it another way and it's okay. Yeah, sometimes depending on your mood too, like mm -hmm. you'll get a different feel and different emotion from the piece that you look at. I really love some of the pieces in there, especially when you can use your imagination, the one that didn't have the color inside of it. Right. The, the wahine, it was beautiful. And the, especially the hibiscus, like I can just imagine those colors popping out of it. Right. You might see red, someone else might see a yellow hibiscus. Yeah, exactly. A lot of fun. Mm -hmm.